This is Phil Rizzuto of the New York Yankees. One of the most important plays in offensive baseball is the bunt. There are several kinds of bunts, and you should learn each one. A good bunter is just as valuable to a team as a heavy slugger. First, I'd like to explain the sacrifice bunt. On this bunt, the batter sacrifices himself. That is, he lets an out be made on himself so that a man on base can move into scoring position. Here's how to lay down a sacrifice bunt. No deception is required. Take your regular batting stance at the plate. Just before the ball is delivered, shift your feet so that you're facing the pitcher. Hold the bat loosely. Slide your upper hand about halfway up the bat. Your lower hand guides the bat. Let the ball come to the bat. Don't push at the ball. Another thing, when you're at the plate to sacrifice, don't bunt at a bad pitch. Wait for a strike. If you try to bunt a high or wide pitch, you'll pop the ball into the air. Now I'll tell you about the drag bunt. This bunt is a bid for a base hit, and it's tried when the infielders are playing at normal depth. The ball must be placed between the pitcher and first base. It should be hit hard enough to be out of the pitcher's reach, but not so hard that the second baseman can field it easily. A left-handed hitter has a big advantage here, because he's more than a full step toward first base as his bat meets the ball. You right-handers should keep practicing the drag bunt, though. I'm right-handed, and the drag bunt gets me a few base hits every summer.